Okay, today's Saturday the 3rd. Sorry to have such a little video. I've been busy all day. Um, I didn't get to train today. But what I did get to do, I went to the speak to these people that are doing you know, courses, training courses. And I spoke to the guy about training. And I was saying to him, you know, with all these hours I'm doing, I can't be doing this one muscle a day now. I need to be doing... Um, I was thinking about doing a full body workout twice a day, twice a week or three times a week, whatever. And he goes to me, yeah, he agrees. So I'm going to be doing like a full body workout, like say on a Monday, then have a rest and then um, Wednesday, then have a rest, then Friday, and then probably just do a bit of cardiovascular Saturday or Sunday. I, showed him, I told him what I was eating. He was like, it's not the eating because the eating is fine. I mean, what I'm eating is healthy. I'm eating good. Um... But what he did say to me is that when I was doing that working, doing one muscle a day, even though there was a difference, the reason why it's taking so long is because when I, he said that's more for bodybuilding, when they do one muscle, they do the chest because they completely total the chest and they won't be able to train for another week. And obviously, I don't do bodybuilding. Bodybuilding is just too much. I mean, what they're doing, first of all, using steroids. They're completely killing the chest. And they need a rest. They need a rest or, I don't know, five days to rest whatever muscle they've done. So, um, so I'm just going to be doing a full body workout every other day now. Um, I've got work from like 9 to 5 tomorrow. I'm going to go to the gym. Which is gonna be yeah, which is gonna be Sunday, um. But I should be back at the gym on Monday. Um. It's not easy going to the gym. There are always hours, but trust me, I'm gonna make an effort to go three times a week. Um, and you watch the difference. But yeah, that was something new I learned today. So I mean, even I was saying, even he was even saying to me is that with personal trainers. Um, thirty percent is the th theory part, and seventy percent is, um, like interacting. You know, you need to be able to talk to people. You can't be like to them, okay, do three, do three reps. It'll be like, come on, do three reps. You know, you got to talk to people. You know, and then that's me. I'm a motivator. I'm a talker. You know, I talk to people. You know, I'm constantly interacting with people. And that's what you need to be able to do when you do personal training. It's not all about the theory. I mean, if you can't talk to people, I don't know, you're not going to really get that far. Um, but yeah, I'm going to upload another video. I've got home. Just got home. It's so late. I'm tired. I a bit of family guy and just go to sleep. But yeah, I'll upload another video tomorrow. See ya. <sighs>